Right, hello and welcome back to another video. Today back with something different. It's going to be another transfer news video. Uh, unfortunately, Luke cannot be on this one um, as he's busy. Um, obviously, I couldn't be on the previous one because I was still in Zante. So, yeah, you know, sorry for the lack of uploads recently. But, um, yeah, this time it'll be my turn to do a video on my own. Obviously, as I said, Luke did the last one. Um, but, yeah, I'm obviously back from Zante now. So, hopefully the content can, um, you know, continue. And hopefully we can make as many videos as we can. But um, um, in today's video... We're here to talk about um, the free signing of Josh Ginnelly. Um But before we touch on that, we're going to talk about uh, Michael Duff. Obviously, we didn't get the chance to do so. Um, obviously, he was appointed about a week ago now. But um, yeah, obviously, the Swans are on pre-season at the moment. Yeah. I've watched Michael Duff's interview. He looks promising. You know, he looks like he's you know very optimistic and you know wants to build something here and wants to you know achieve success here. So hopefully, that's what we can do. Um, as I said, yeah, he seems like a good manager. Obviously, took Barnsley to the um, playoff final last year. Um, did a good job there, from you know what I've heard from Barnsley fans and what I've seen of Barnsley last season as well. Um, so yeah, hopefully he can you know bring that um, and insert that over to us. To be honest with you, but um, yeah, now going on to Josh Ginnelly then. So um, yeah, he's a left midfielder. Um, obviously, he's been um, he's a free agent because um, he didn't resign his contract with Hearts. Uh, 26 years old, so you know, coming to the sort of, you know, middle. Well, it's coming to the prime of his career actually. Really, um, obviously, as I said, he was a free agent, so you know, it's a really good deal to be honest with you. Um, I do remember he did have um, uh, a spell at Preston as well. I didn't play many games, but I remember him playing for Preston. Um, he's also played for a number of other clubs: Burnley, Warsaw, Shrewsbury, Lincoln. So yeah, you know, he's been around. He played for quite a few clubs, considering he's only 26. Um, but uh, yeah, as I said, you know, he'd be a very good player for us, and I think it's a great deal. The fact you know we've got um, a fairly experienced player. Um, you know, he's, he's played in the Championship. He's also played in the Scottish Premiership. So, you know, as I said, he's got experience for twenty six years old, and to get him on a free transfer, you know, it's great. And I, I think we lack, we we do really lack wide midfielders. I think you know, the only player who can really play there in our squad is Morgan Whitaker, um, and that's that's about it. So, you know, to be honest with you. But yeah, we do really like wide players, so um, yeah, I think it's a very good deal. Um, obviously, as I said, he, he made um, well, he had two spells at Hearts. The first one was alone um, in the twenty 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 one season. Um, he played six games and scored three goals, so that's a goal every two games. So yeah, that, that's not not a bad uh, bad track record at all. And then obviously he signed permanently then for Hearts, and he was there from twenty twenty one till twenty twenty three. So he was there for two seasons playing 61 games and scoring 17 goals. So, again, not a bad record. Not great, but, you know, not bad. Um, and, you know, I hope he can add a bit of flair. Um, I haven't seen much of him, to be honest with you, I'll be honest. But, um, you know, he looks like a decent player um, from, you know, his stats at Hearts and from his time at Preston. But, um, yeah, I really hope that, you know, now we can, you know, hopefully make a few more signings. Um, be interesting to see where he fits in, you know. Will, will he play... Um, in, in, in a 4-4-2, will we now play that with, with Ginnelly in the side? Um, will we play a 4-3-3? Will he play on the wing? Will he play wide midfield? Maybe he could even play up front. Um, be interesting to see what players um, Duff will play around him as well. You know, whether Perot, Patterson, Ollie Cooper, you know, we've got uh, Morgan Whitaker, Carl Joseph. We've got a lot of attacking options to play around him. So I wonder where he'll fit into the team. And, um, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm hoping that, you know, he can get some game time in pre-season and um, kick on because you know our first sign of the season and it's quite good because we made a first sign of the season quite early on in the transfer window so hopefully that's you know um, you know hopefully that means more to come um, obviously I know we've been linked with a few other players like Josh Key, Ellis Sims so you know very very I'm, not, I'm, I'm trying to be hopeful about that I hope we can sign you know those two players because Ellis Sims is a cracking player especially at this level and um, you know Josh Key looks a tidy promising uh, player for the future as well so if we can sign them that would be great but um, yeah the signing of Josh Ginnelly you know really excites me to be honest with you um, especially they got him on a free uh, excellent deal to be honest with you and um, hopefully you know we can kick on and try and try and change um, change the way we play but um, yeah obviously massive thanks for watching this once again um, we will be back with some more videos soon. Obviously, Luke will be back on the channel soon. We'll be making videos together um, before the pre-season. Obviously, we'll be doing championship table predictions. Um, maybe we'll vlog a few games. Um, pre-season friendlies, depending on 
um, where we go. I don't know if we'll be t attending any away pre-season friendlies, but I know we've got a home one against Bristol City, uh, major watch longs for the away one. So yeah, uh, we'll definitely videos will definitely be back. Um, but yeah, obviously massive thanks for watching this, and um, yeah, welcome to Swansea City, Josh Ginnelly.